Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the Grippos. These are fat-free pretzel loops. And I have their uh, barbecue cheese flavored popcorn. Uh, Grippos, we have reviewed a lot of Grippos on the channel, uh, mainly potato chips and stuff like that, but they're made right in uh, Cincinnati, Ohio, so it's a brand that we see a lot around here. For some reason, though, we just miss these things. Mm -hmm. um, I'm sure they've been around forever. The popcorn was $2.79 and the pretzels were $3.29. We found them both at Kroger. So... And, and I'd never seen the pretzels before. Our son, Andrew, his favorite barbecue chips are Grippos. That's because they're sweet and hot. They he got, loves they're sweet, them. but they're heat. For Christmas this year, we bought him, where did we buy that? We bought him a box. GFS. We've seen that a couple it. different that places. Was it. GFS, I think GFS they had boxes of Grippos of the individual bags. It's like 40 bags. Yeah, <laughs> and we wrapped it up and gave him that whole box of like 40. I bet you they're gone already. Uh, 40 individual bags of Grippos because he loves them so much. Um, so anyway, these are, uh, they say they have rods, they pretzel rods, they have barbecue chips, caramel popcorn, cheese nibs. Um, have we tried the cheese nibs? Mm -hmm. yeah, have I we? So. Um, 15 servings in the container, one ounce, 28 grams, about 11 pieces is 100 calories. And you might be wondering why, why I would try pretzels because pretzels, you know, everybody makes pretzels. These are so dark. Yeah, they, I mean, they look like they had a good amount of salt on them. They too. look like they almost burnt them. <laughs> so we're like, and they we, all look like that too. Yeah, so we're like, we have to, to try these pretzels. You know what though, pretzels, different brand pretzels taste different. They yeah. really do. I have to try these pretzels because they are some dark pretzels. I've never tried them in loops before. That's, that's neat. These it's are literally like a. Rings. Yeah, yeah, literally. Yeah. Yeah, they're pretty crunchy. Mm -hmm. www.grippo, not with an S, grippopotatochips.com. That looks like a nice pretzel. And it does have that little. A little bit of a scorched flavor, don't it? Mm -hmm. I like it. I don't. You don't? It's no. too scorched for you? It's too scorched for me. And you know what? I like scorched food, but that's really scorched. It, it does have almost a burnt flavor. I think those would be better with um, like a beer or something. Really? You know really? I'm going to take back. I don't like the aftertaste. No, it's too strong. It's too scorched. It's literally like you've eaten um, uh, burnt, it's burnt toast. Yeah, it's, it tastes burnt. Yeah, I agree. I'm wondering who's buying The initial this. flavor I liked, mm -hmm. and I love the crunch. It's got a hard crunch to it, mm -hmm. but yeah, the burnt flavor is just too much for me. No, it, it tastes like they burnt them, but now every bag on the shelf was like yeah, that. Yeah, all like that. So this is the way they make them. Yeah, I wouldn't want to eat that with a cheeseburger or a... No, I wouldn't either like because you're getting a burnt flavor, mm -hmm. but... It, it's funny how Kevin and R are, uh, are about stuff like that because like pizza, we like love it. it. We love crispiness. it a little scorched. And I get comments all the time you know, saying, like We wouldn't like it if the whole thing's black on top. That's true. Uh, but I get comments saying, oh, you burnt it, you ruined it. And I'm like, oh no, heck no. This is the way we like to eat mm -hmm. pizza. This is awesome to us. The, to us, this is perfect. Um, but those are burnt. Yeah. Some people like pizzas just barely melted. Yeah, no. And it's, no, I want a little no, crispy no, cheese. No, 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 <laughs> no. And and I I want it hot too. I don't want the pizza. We there's a, a pizza place in Lexington, and last time we were there, it's been a while. But last time we were there, they brought us this pizza, and it was it was almost like it room wasn't even room temperature hardly. And yeah. it's like I want my pizza hot. Yeah, funny. Know. Okay, I'm funny about that. Okay, uh, barbecue cheese flavored popcorn. Uh, seven servings in the container. Two cups, 30 grams is 190 calories. Okay. Now, now I like their barbecue flavor. I was just like, we know we like their chips. They also sell, if you wanted to add that barbecue flavor to your own popcorn, they sell the powder. Yes, I think we... That you can we, sprinkle on popcorn. I think we I think did a review that. of the, the powder too. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what we put it on, but... We might have put it on popcorn. Might have. Now that I'm thinking about it. Mm. I yep. bet we did. I don't look. remember. Yep, that's the barbecue. Ooh, wow. Watch <laughs> wow. It has got a little bit of a sweet kick, but Holy boy, moly. That's spicier than their chips are. Oh, yeah. This has, uh, and there's that smoky too. Ooh. Smoky flavor. Um, 
let's see, it has corn flour, onion powder, garlic powder, natural hickory smoke flavor, caramel yeah, flavor. Oh yeah, definitely got smoky. Paprika extract. I don't know yeah. what it is. It's, it's probably the paprika. Okay. I mean, that is seriously spicy. Mm -hmm. I'm shocked that they did not call these spicy. Spicy barbecue. Yeah, if you didn't know Grippo's, you wouldn't know they were spicy. Their chips are pretty hot, though. Yeah, but that's and they're like super thick coated chips. They are. They're um, very well coated. They do a good job. I think it's just because the seasoning can get in all these little nooks and crannies with those popcorn. It's really, really hot. I'm telling you, that is twice as hot. They could have called those spicy. It's twice as hot as their chips. I don't think so. I think it's about the same. You really do. Mm -hmm. You just haven't had them for a while. Mm -mm, no, I haven't. Because I had them probably about a month ago. I don't remember my mouth burning, literally yeah. burning after eating a bag. You usually get used to it mm -hmm. after a few chips. This mm -hmm. one seems to be lingering a little longer. You so know what, I agree though? there. I do like it. It's I a do. softer popcorn. It, it, it's got a good flavor to it. Mm -hmm. I like it. It doesn't really taste like cheese much. I think because the, the barbecue covers it up a lot. If you can't handle heat though and you bought these, because right. nowhere on like here it. does it say hot. This this is gonna set you on fire. Yeah, because if you're not used to that Grippo's barbecue, you wouldn't know it was spicy like that. Mm -hmm. So you're thinking a traditional barbecue over here is just smoky and and sweet kind of almost uh, brown sugar like. Mm -hmm. um, this is not that kind no, of. No, this is <laughs> hot. This has set you on fire. But out of the two, I would definitely buy these. Um, I would sit there and eat those. The pretzels are a little like I said. It's got that little scorch flavor. I don't really care for the aftertaste. These are. If you like Grippo's potato chips, I think you would like the popcorn. But there's going to be people out there that are crazy about those pretzels. Oh, yeah. So you'll have to let us know if you've tried these Grippo's. Because we've had dark pretzels before. Like Schneider's of Hanover has mm. some dark pretzels. It's not like this though. Mm. You need to try this brand and tell us what you think. Yeah, because they're re like really, really overbaked. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just different. But truth be told is I like this popcorn, but I would just soon stick with their potato chips. Yeah, it's pretty hot. It's lingering longer than the potato chips do. Yes, <laughs> it does. It's still here. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have pictures for you at the end. And thanks for watching.